it's Jay here. Welcome to this week's Troubleshooting with Jay. As you can see, I'm being a little practical today. So I was going to talk to you about soaking off um, your powder polish. And um, a lot of people have asked me different questions on soaking off. And so I have Grace here and, you know, my emergency help. So, hi Grace, put your head in and say good day. This is Grace. Hi. hi. Yeah, just because... Um, Soon I'm going to be soaking in it and I may not be able to do what I'm planning on. So this uh, doesn't have a script, so let's just see how we go. So at the moment, the first thing that I have done is I have uh, removed the shine from my nails with my electric file. I haven't taken much bulk off of the nail. I just, just took the shine off because I like to use gel polish on my powder polish. So I need, obviously if I'm going to soak, that's not going to work. I have my soak bowl here. You can see it here has two little soaky thingies in it and it is slightly warm. Um, I recommend that you use our um, EFB's gel soak off solution. I just feel like it works better. So, so far I've got a timer and it's taken me three minutes, five seconds at 0.73, if you're gonna be you know, particular, just to remove the shine with my electric file. Because I just wanna see how long it's going to take. So I keep telling everybody that, it's, that I can get my mum's off between eight and 12 minutes. And then I was like, hmm, can I get mine off between eight and 12 minutes? So let's give it a bill and this is what I do in real life. So I'm sorry if it's boring, but you know, hey. So I'm just going to pour in my um, soak off solution. I have tried acetone and I have tried the soak off solution. I did the soak off solution by accident um, because I couldn't be bothered to walk into the training room <laughs> um, and I didn't have any acetone. Okay, so I'm gonna press start and in I go. So, oh, and now it's um, yeah, so I couldn't be bothered to go into the training room and I had my soak off solution and I thought, oh, oh I'll just use that and realised that it seemed to do the job a bit quicker than normal. And then the following time uh, Jude came in for her, her fill, I did one hand acetone and one hand gel soak off and by far the gel soak off solution was faster. And I think the price is pretty even, isn't it? Yeah. Like for acetone to, yeah, to gel? Yeah, it's about the same, maybe a dollar different. Maybe a dollar, a dollar but that dollar is gonna save you in time. So while I'm soaking, we're gonna, we're gonna soak here for about five minutes. The reason that I like to soak in a bowl as opposed to, um, opposed to you know, individuals there's a couple of reasons and I've kind of gone backwards. So if you like to soak individually, I do recommend that you use our finger mates. The reason that I recommend that you use our finger mates and maybe Grace could just go get one there in the top drawer there um, just to show you is because often if you use foil, in order to get the foil to stick to the fingers, what happens is, is that the solution that's in the foil ends up all down your arm and then doesn't stay on. So you can see these are the finger mates and maybe you could just go a bit closer to the camera and just put one on your own finger. Yes. You put the solution onto the... Um, onto the foam yeah. and then you use the finger mate and here's Grace just you know, trying to do just it kind really of squeeze fast. yeah that's it and, and basically the there so pretty much the solution stays in the in the plastic the and you're not squeezing it out so you can use that but the reason so we have those the reason that thanks Grace no. Um, she's such a super duper, you know, she's <laughs> such a super duper um, assistant. Anyway, so that's the reason. But I figure that by the time I've individually done each individual one, um, I could have just poured the solution in and already be soaking and it's already in action. So I like to slowly warm and I just like a disclaimer here. This is a disclaimer. I am not telling you to heat acetone. I am not telling you to... Um, put it in the microwave. I'm not telling solvents are flammable. Do not heat them hot But if you use a wheat bag and then bury bury your solution into the wheat bag a slightly warmer solution will work a little bit quicker So that's what I'm telling you to do. I'm not telling you to heat the solution I don't want anyone coming back to me saying in fact, I'm saying to you right now do not heat the solution under any circumstances. Got me? Got me? It's dangerous, dangerous. Mm -hmm. I think they got that. Didn't no, they? I think they got yeah, it. Okay. I think right. Yeah, Because, you know, I just yeah. would hate somebody to say, but I'm slowly warming this solution. It just takes the edge off. And my product's starting to move off of my nails. And I'm gonna leave this for five minutes. 
So what I might do is just stop this video. We're going to try this. It might not work. And we're going to try to put this video together so you don't have to watch time lapse. So I'm going to pause, um, stop this video now. And after five minutes, I'm going to come back and um, show you where we're up to. Okay. Okay, welcome back. So, you know, to the beauty of technology that we don't know how to do yet, so I hope this can work. You can see that it's 8.05 um, and a few seconds because we're a bit slow. So what I want Grace to do is just come over and have a look at my, you know, bring this and just sort of tilt it into the, the, the liquid. Mm -hmm. So you can see, see my nails really are horrible. starting to come off and you can see all the lovely glitter in the purple. Oh, it's so pretty. Now, anyone, okay, thanks, and you can go yeah. back. So anyone who knows my nails, um, who's had experience with my nails, knows that I have the world's worst nails. So I have to um, do quite a bit of building with my nails. So I have to build quite a bit of structure. And so therefore they are quite a bit thicker than normal. But you can see that um, there's quite a bit of product that's come off. Um, obviously this one, um, not so much. So maybe I wasn't po poking in as much. So after five minutes, what I do is I get a bit of my table towel and put it in the bottom of my um, in the bottom of my soap bowl. And now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go for another sort of eight, um, another three minutes or so, and I'm just going to scrub my nails. Like I'm just going to rub my nails against the table towel. You can kind of see me doing it in the video. And as I'm doing that, I'm sort of adding a bit more pressure, so I'm sort of scrubbing it off. Okay, we forgot to press. We forgot to press start. Okay, so, okay, let's just pretend that that part was faster and we might add a minute on. So we've just started the bit, the time. <laughs> Crap! So we'll just, look, it says one minute 37 that I've been on video. So I've been in and out of the solution. So that'll just give you a bit of a clue um, that, yeah, sorry, that we're not that technical, but at least you get an idea of what I'm doing. Okay, so I'm just, I'm just scrubbing them like that inside the, the liquid. All right, so let's stop the video and I'll come back at the end of, okay, so it's 8.30, so we'll do it, um, we'll do it in three minutes. We'll come back in, in three minutes and have a look where we're up to. Hello again. Okay, so look at the timer. So now we're at 11 minutes. So we started at three minutes, so now we're at eight minutes. So if Grace can put that down, I'm not gonna mess about with my iPhone anymore. I just want, can you just bring a bit closer so I can show them what's happening. This, this towel is the magic key because take a look, this is my nails. So there's a tiny little bit still, like you can see that there's a little bit left on there and there, and that's because they're glitter and it's difficult to sort of get them. So you could probably leave them for another two minutes. Yeah, you can put them back. Um, and you could, you know, you as the remover, like if you wanted to start, you could use a curette and just sort of grab, but I don't even, it's really gone. There's no need to do that. Um, you, you know, when I bring out my mum, like clearly on the side of my thumb here, I can't get in. So you could scrub that or just hit it with your file anyway. Um, so there's very little damage to the nail. So I recommend that if you do five minutes, uh, five minutes in with just plain soaking, yeah, like look at that, they're really off. They're off. Like they yeah. really are off. Yeah. They just need a bit of a buff and prep before I'm ready to go again. So, um, and then, yes, there is a little bit of remover that is wasted, but at the end of the day, time is money and solution is cheap. So you'll be able to work out a way to refine that in the smallest amount. The blue towel is the key. So if you don't have any blue towel, you know, give Grace a call and she'll certainly hook you up. It's the best thing since last bread. I just love it. It's, you know, um, and slowly warm. This is not hot. It's still, it's just off of ice cold, like the actual temperature of the, of the thing. Put your finger in there, Grace, and tell me how cold it is. It's still cold. Oh, yeah, it's not. It's, it's just not hot. The edge, the edge is off. You know, yes, whereas not this nice. is really freezing, so it just sort of takes the edge off. So it's not heated in any way, shape, or form. And then you just um, clean that out and throw it away. Oh, there's my nails. Eight minutes. Soak off. Proven. Hope that helps. If you've got any questions, sing out. Um, I'm off to do my nails. You know, I can apply the set now in 22 minutes. Woohoo! Can you do that? And um, if you like, please like and share. And I will see you next week. Lots of love. Mwah.